has not changed. Circa 1983. Yeah. Yep. And the photos will prove just that. And we're underway here at the barn. Well, Joseph goes baseline. Instead, it's Hawkins. He'll fire for three, and it goes down for the transfer from Howard. Loose on the floor and run down by Christie. Mitchell to Carrington, wide open look. And it goes in transition. Carrington knocks it down. Payne sets the screen for Mitchell, draws two. Fox feeds Payne. He's double teamed. He missed Mitchell on the dive cut. Got it back down low and scored. Gophers now have hit on five threes so far here tonight. Passing the ball well. Deep. As Williams, he checked time for him from deep. Answers back for Arkansas Pine Bluff. It's one and one, ninth team foul. And got the rebound back off the deflection. It scores off the glass. Through the opening half. Williams will fire. And why not? He has 20 of the Golden Lions, 24 points. Hawkins underneath, feeds Garcia, slashing, catching, and dunking. Nice timing there by Garcia of not executing that dive cut too early. Milton try to answer back, cannot, he turns it over. Hawkins will lob, oh, Johnson throws it down. There's an early Thanksgiving appetizer right there. Right here on the Big Ten Network, Friday, I'm sorry, Saturday at 2.30 Central. The timeout, Plep down low, found some space and dunked it down. Pretty good job by Fox of moving his feet and then completing the play by walling up. See it with four rebounds. Mitchell up top, lets it fly, and down it goes. Again, he's aiming the basketball for He's not shooting it, letting it go freely. Meanwhile, Pine Bluff answers on the shot from Martin. A ton of options. Here's a lob. Touch pass Garcia with four to shoot. Down to two, stripped down the floor, turnover, shot clock off. Here's Milton in transition, lays it up and in. Here is Williams. Martin open for three, and it's good basketball there from Pine Bluff. Fox against Plett. It's Betts, doesn't pass up this three. Tipped around into the hands of Fox. He'll drive, lays it up, no, tip, yes, and a foul. Nice, Johnson nice. staying with the same five, and nice basketball there, leaving Plett open for the dunk. In the Maui Invitational Championship game tomorrow. Really solid win for the Boilermakers, because Tennessee is a potential Final Four team, and they get after you defensively. Competition. You know we live in a country now where you give out participation trophies. Oh, Pharrell Payne came back when it looked like an easy two. He got back and swatted that one away. Competition, especially in practice, makes everybody better. Hey. Williams bumped wow. and that'll count in one. Daring the larger Golden Gophers to shoot over the top. Two on one, the low! as Milton feeds Lewis, and this game is now into single digits for the first time. So one of ten shooting from beyond the arc this half for Minnesota. 15 foul, by the way, on the Golden Lions. Garcia and one! Well, Joseph goes baseline and dunks it down! Mm. Not expecting that pass. Well, and it was behind him as well. And Williams throws it away. Christie up the floor. Ola Joseph, he'll dunk it down. Nice job by Ola Joseph of moving his feet. Williams from deep. And there's the form we saw in the first half. Hasn't been falling here in the second half, but still time left. Ryan Bluff has missed on his last six from the field. Can French change that? Yes, he does. Made a line change, but in the end, the Gophers pull away and win 86-67 to grab their fourth win of the season. And you know the positives that they can take as they go on the road 